I shall lend you my strength. Indeed. Is that the winged sun crest you bear? So in the end, it was you who held the final piece. That rightfully belongs to the gods of the Nile. A faction of renegade demons stole it from its true place. Whoever bears that crest can wield the divine power of the Sun God. The power of creation of all things. This jar contains the boy's flesh and bones. With Ra's power joined to mine, I would be able to restore him to life. All I require is that crest and your cooperation. Together, we can bring Yuzuru Atsuta back to life. Will you assist me? Young man, if you do hand over the winged sun crest, Konsu will gain immense power. Before deciding, think carefully on the potential consequences of this choice. Thank you. Now we can proceed with the right. First, however, there is someone who wishes to speak to you. Miyazu Atsuda. So, I'm glad to see you're okay. Thank you. Even after everything that's happened, you still haven't given up. But me... Soon your pain will fade, Miyazu. Look upon this crest. It is the Eye of Horus. Now it shall be restored to its rightful owner. In the name of Raharakti, grant me the divine power of the king. Now the power of Ra is mine. Yet before I revive Miyazu's brother, there is one further task I must attend to. I must deliver your judgment. Director Kushimizu, my brother was your knowledge. And you used him. You put him in danger, just so you could get everything you wanted. If it wasn't for you, my brother would never have been dragged into this war. Wouldn't have had to die. Yet not content with losing your own knowledge as bearer, you dared reach further, finding a replacement in him. Yazu and I are of one mind. We doubt that you are truly worthy of the throne. Young man, we can't afford to indulge this. We've come too far to stop now. We have to keep fighting, or all the sacrifices that brought us here will have meant nothing. I, Konsu Ra, hereby decree, you will face me here and now, Nahobino. Suffer the flames of my judgment and be cleansed! I shall pass judgment!
I shall pass judgment! brother back, then at least, at the very least. I thought as much. There was never any hope of reviving Yuzuru Atsuda. It was all a bluff for the sake of confronting us. Even with the power of Ra, the human you knew as Yuzuru Atsuda will not return. All I could do was hasten the reincarnation of his soul. So, I thought even if I couldn't have my brother back, I could at least avenge him. But I don't care anymore. I never wanted to lose you to get my revenge. Then I really would be alone. I want to live for the future. With you at my side. My brother is the only one who would know what he wanted. I don't know if you can speak for him like that, but I've decided I want to live for myself. Young man, would you let me offer her a few words in parting? Your brother cared about helping people. That's ultimately what he wanted to achieve with his power. He wasn't bound by anyone else's orders. He was acting for a cause he believed in. My hope is to create a world that will keep his vision and others like it, alive, forever. That is our purpose in seeking the throne. I guess I never realized my brother had that kind of determination. I want to choose the path I believe in, too. So I'll stand back and give this world a last farewell as it ends. I feel like that's the only way I have left to take a stand against this rotten war. Well, Nahobino, if that is your path, then so be it. After suffering defeat at your hands, I've no right to object. But never forget, 
As you walk onward, you bear the hopes of countless humans with you. Once the world's remade, you might be the only ones who can preserve the memory of the one we used to live in. So even after all this is over, please, don't forget my brother. Welcome to the world of shadows, where demons gather. I am Consul. Let us fight as one. Yes. Thank you. 